What is up you guys? Long time no see. So welcome back to my channel. I know I only got one video up this past week, but my aunt was in town visiting and honestly, I just wasn't in the mood to film. I hardly was on any social media and it was just really nice to unplug and unwind and enjoy this time that I had with my aunt. We actually have family coming up today. If I didn't say today's Saturday, so happy weekend vlog. I don't think I'm gonna film while they're here, but I'm actually about to go run a few errands. They're, they're unfortunately running super behind schedule. So I'm gonna run to Home Goods right now. I just got this super cute tray in from Target and I wanna find a cute floral arrangement to go inside the tray. And yeah, I figured today I'd pick up the camera. I actually really missed filming, so I told Andrew, I'm gonna try to vlog this weekend. Um, my best friends are coming up tomorrow, so we have just had guests since Sunday. And you guys, the movers come Tuesday, and I can't believe it's already pretty much moving day. I have gotten, I think, two of our luggages packed. I had to order another checked-in luggage off Amazon because the five we already have just aren't gonna cut it. I needed at least one more. So I ordered one more luggage from Amazon and that already came. So I probably will start packing that either tonight after family leaves. But you guys, things are getting so real. I hope everyone's having a great week and a great weekend. Andrew officially checks out of his command on Monday. So after that, I mean, he's not on vacation, but after that, he's pretty much off work for a little while, which is so nice. We are going back to our hometown for just two days before before we have to go to Northern California for Andrew's school. And then we leave Northern California on the 23rd. And I have a hair appointment and a Botox appointment on the 24th. And then we also need to turn in this car and then we're gonna have a rental. Sorry, the camera fell, so if the positioning is different, that is why. Also, if my camera's bumpy, I'm sorry. I didn't feel like putting up the car mount. But anyways, the day before we fly out to Japan, which is Monday, because we fly out on a Tuesday, we have to drive back up here to our area because the dogs have one last doctor's appointment. And then that's pretty much it. So we're gonna be go, 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 starting. Actually, we already started. Started starting this week we're gonna be go 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 pretty much until the day that we leave so we're gonna be so busy I am still gonna try to film some content for you guys also we do have one free weekend up in Northern California and I think we're gonna take a drive to the Sequoias I grew up going there as a kid and I really really want to take Stella so where Andrew's school's at is exactly two hours from the Sequoias and if you guys have ever been the Sequoias is just so beautiful there's nothing like the smell of redwoods. I know that sounds so crazy, but I always say I wish they could perfect the redwood smell in a candle because I would have that burning throughout my house 24 seven. So we're gonna take a little staycation that one weekend we have free, so I'm so excited. So I definitely will be filming our little trip there as well. We're not gonna be camping because by the time we get there, it's gonna be the middle of October. So that's considered still winter time, I guess. But we're gonna rent a cabin and I'm so excited. Um, it's gonna be cold, but it's not gonna be snowing, I don't think. So we'll start be able to do hiking and just show Stella around because like I said I grew up going there and I haven't been in years so I'm so excited for that um, so yeah that's everything that's been going on we just have tons of visitors moving <laughs> A lot has been happening, but I'm so, so excited. So after Home Goods, I need to go to Chipotle to pick up Stella a kid's plate because like I said, our family's running super late and they technically should have been here already. It's 12 o'clock or actually 12.30 and they're running a few hours behind actually. So Stella is taking a nap right now and I know when she wakes up, she's gonna be starving. So after Home Goods, we'll see what I could find for my little tray for the coffee table. I'm gonna run to Chipotle, come back home but I'll show you guys a few things that I've been buying because although I haven't been posting that much on social media or even filming, I have been buying a lot of last minute things that we need for the house. So I'll just catch you guys in Home Goods. Okay, that was, I regret going in there. It's Saturday and of course Home Goods was so, so 
crowded. So Monday, I actually have free time and I much rather go shopping when everyone's at work. So I'm about to head to Chipotle, grab Stella some food. Andrew actually just texted me saying that she woke up, so I know she's probably hungry. Maybe grab a Starbucks, should I? Mm, I'm not sure. I'll probably call Andrew to see how far his family is and then decide if I'm gonna get some Starbucks. Okay, so I got the Chipotle. Andrew said his family is about 45 minutes away, which means an hour away at least. So I'm in the Starbucks drive-thru. Hold on, this line is ridiculous. All right, so I just pulled in to the Starbucks drive-thru and I'm gonna get my iced chai with the pumpkin cold foam on top and Andrew wants a pumpkin cold brew. So that's what I'm gonna get. This morning I woke up super early, worked out, we deep cleaned the house since we're having guests over today and tomorrow. But how's everyone doing? Even though I haven't picked up the camera in about a week, it feels longer than that. And like I said, I missed it, I missed you guys. So while I'm in the Starbucks drive through I'll go ahead and catch you guys up on a couple of things so I just placed a huge order for myself off Abercrombie and H&M kids for Stella so I do have a huge haul coming up going up on my channel soon I shipped everything to Andrew's grandparents house and both things have both shipped we will arrive I think to his grandparents house on Wednesday so hopefully the items are there waiting for me when I get there so that way Thursday and Friday I could do a try on haul also I just got <laughs> I, I've been doing so much shopping. Andrew says I have a problem, and honestly, I do. I have a problem, but I'm just trying to go over there prepared so I have an excuse, you know what I mean? But um, I just received one of my Abercrombie orders that I ordered about two weeks ago the other day. So I'll probably include some of those items in the weekend vlog, so stay tuned for that later on in the video. What else, what else, what else? I feel like there's just so much that has been going on and I haven't updated you guys in a while so I can't think it's one o'clock and I'm literally starving this morning Andrew was so sweet and made breakfast he made Trader Joe's hash browns and eggs and I ate that after I worked out so I got to do fasted cardio which I love it's always so hard to do some fasted cardio because usually Stal is with me but when Andrew's home I try to take advantage and do some fasted cardio I'm obviously not gonna have a treadmill when the movers come pack up on Tuesday so I'm gonna miss working out I am gonna keep some booty bands and my slides and a few things in my luggage that are not bulky where I could actually get a decent workout in but the gyms in Japan are open so I'm actually so excited to step foot in the gym because although I have a decent setup at home nothing absolutely nothing is like working out at a gym there's just nothing like it and I really miss it I miss having that me time so once we're out of quarantine and get kind of settled I'm gonna definitely hit up the gym oh I bought Stella the cutest I know it's months away actually two months but I bought Stella the cutest Christmas outfit yesterday oh my god it is so cute it's perfect it's obviously in my favorite color it's blush and it has like gold dotted glitter throughout it it's so so cute I don't even know if there's gonna be Santa pictures this year but I don't care like we're still gonna celebrate Christmas because anyone who knows me knows I love Christmas and yesterday we actually stumbled upon the cutest Christmas shop and it had tons of Christmas decor clothing cups <laughs> I mean anything you could think of for Christmas they had so I bought a couple of things also we took my aunt to the outlet I want to say a couple of days ago and we got Stella two new pairs of shoes so I'll go ahead and show you guys that later on in the vlog as well I'm trying to think there's so much going on I just feel like I'm stressed I'm not gonna lie but I'm also calm I don't know if that makes sense at all I'm stressed with everything that we have going on but I don't know I'm like calm and like so excited for the next few weeks I don't know if that makes any sense at all like that probably doesn't make sense but in my head it makes sense I'm not gonna lie to you guys this time last week I was so stressed so stressed and not only that like Stella has been having moments but knock on wood where is their wood I don't even think I have wood in my car but knock on wood um, she's been so good this week so sweet I swear within the past week or two you guys Stella has grown so much she is just taller smarter sassier 
saying more words. She's becoming a kid more now than ever, and it's so awesome to see. So she's been a lot of fun, but also kind of stressing me out because she's totally like me where she's very like, will powered and wants her way if that makes sense and stubborn so i've been dealing with that which has been so much fun dealing with the two-year-old i mean i'm not gonna lie it's more fun with her than it is bad but she's still man she's a toddler going on to a teenager and i just don't know where our baby went so i'm definitely gonna have to show you guys stella her in a bit because i swear within this past week she's grown so much so i'm actually about to get up to the drive through right here and order my drink this line's actually going by really fast i'm literally about to have one of stella's chips sorry stella these are actually her favorite but i'm so so hungry i'm so hungry thank you for choosing starbucks what can i get started for you can I get a venti iced chai with soy, but with only um, one pump of sugar-free vanilla, two pumps of chai, and one pump of your pumpkin? All right, two pumps of sugar-free, oh wait, no, two pumps of chai, one pump of sugar-free vanilla, and soy. And soy, and then a half a pump of your pumpkin? A half a pump of the pumpkin? Yes, please. And then can you also make, can you add a shot of espresso to that? Okay. And then, sorry, can you also add the pumpkin cold foam on top of the chai? Okay. And then also just a grande um, pumpkin cold cold brew? Okay. And All right, that, just a heads up, there is dairy in the pumpkin itself too, is that okay? Oh no, that's fine, yeah, that's okay, fine. Okay, perfect. All right, and then you said a grande pumpkin cold brew, okay. And that should be it. All right, I'll see you at the window. Thank you. This girl was so nice. Sophia always says, oh my God, I always feel bad ordering my drink with like all these like little details, but I don't feel bad, but I'm sure it could be annoying, but that girl was super nice. We're supposed to be going to this taco truck actually, but now that it's getting later, I don't know if they're gonna be closed. So I'm actually gonna call Andrew because I think they close early on Saturdays. So we'll see. Uh, what time does the um, taco truck co close, by the way? Uh, I don't know. Yeah, I was just thinking that because sometimes on Saturdays they close early, which is weird, but. Which is what? I said sometimes on Saturdays they close early, or sometimes some of them are not even open. Um, okay. All right. Um, I'm getting our drinks right here. I'm like two cars behind and then. I'll be on my way home. Right. I'm, so yeah, I'm, I'm sure. Um, all right, I'll be home right now then. Okay, love Bye. you. Bye. Hello. Hi. Did you need straws today? No. Oh, no, it's okay. Okay. All right, there's that. Thank you. That. Thank you. Okay. You too. I'm so excited! All right, I'm gonna drive home safely, enjoy my drink, listen to some music, and I'll see you guys when I get home. All right, I just got home. Stella is still in PJs. She was eating pirate booty, so she's not eating. She's not even touching her food. Come on, Andrew's up over there. He's about to let the dogs out. I need to quickly make my bed. <laughs> Oh, daddy's gonna come back, baby. I'm gonna show you guys the cardigans that, that I got from Abercrombie real quick. I also grabbed some shirts, but I'll show you guys that later in the vlog. But look how freaking cute this cardigan is. I got the size extra, extra small. It also has a hood and some pockets, but look how freaking cozy this is. I absolutely love it, and I don't know, I just love white. I love this one. I'll try to link everything in the description box below. I'll go ahead and show you guys my next cardigan. Next, I wanted to share this one. This is just a really pretty brown rust color. Also, this one isn't as thick and bulky as the last one. So this one's great for when it's not super cold, but just a little chilly, and again, I love this color for fall. I thought it was so freaking cute and it's super super comfortable but Andrew just said that his family's three minutes away so I'm just gonna have to finish this haul a little later but I don't think I'm gonna film while they're here so I'll I will either pick up the vlog 
back again later on. Stella, you gotta eat. Okay, now she's like barely touching her food. But I'll probably pick up the camera later on or early tomorrow. Ready? Come on, let's go. Does she need a jacket, you think? Hi guys, good morning, happy Sunday. We are on our way to Trader Joe's right now. Um, my friends are coming over in a little bit, so we, we are gonna buy things for a cheese board and just to barbecue, so come on, Stella. No, 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 hey, she picked up a snail. Why are you such a kid? Why are you such a kid? <laughs> what, spider? It's sorry. There's a spider. <laughs> Ew, you can't touch it. <laughs> okay, daddy got it, daddy got it, daddy got it. Awesome. Good job, dad. Oh, my legs are sore from working out. Okay, we made it. We made it to the car, so we're on our way. Ooh. We are on our way to Trader Joe's. We are just gonna buy stuff, like I said, for a cheese board to barbecue. We honestly are gonna have a really chill day with my friends, so that should be really nice. Andrew and I are just so exhausted. Tomorrow, Andrew checks out of his command, so what time, what time do we have to go do that? Um, I don't know. Okay, perfect, so around this time then, because it's nine. Um, so tomorrow, Stella and I are actually gonna go with Andrew to check out of his command, and I think we're gonna bring them donuts um and probably hang out there for a little bit show stella around again and then that's it and then we have to spend the rest of the day tomorrow i actually might start the moving vlog tomorrow because i have to spend the rest of the day tomorrow packing and basically going through everything so i might get some clips of that for our moving vlog and then tuesday the movers come a lot of the stuff in our house though is already boxed from when we moved into the apartment because we already knew that we'd be moving anyways so hopefully i don't know looking at all of our stuff all the stuff that we have is not going to be hard to box maybe just like our table and like some of our like decorations that they have to like wrap really good but everything else should be pretty quick i'm hoping that only takes them a couple of hours for the move but i'll show you guys how i make my cheese board today and i think that's it i'm not going to film while my friends are here just so that way we could hang out with them but this is our last sunday here how do you feel tired i know we're both tired but we're so excited i don't know even like everyone like people have been messaging me on instagram because i've been really mia this past week and i think i told you i just haven't really been on social media or anything much and it has been nice um but yesterday i posted because i haven't posted in a while and everyone's like oh my gosh are you so excited are you so nervous i'm like no i'm not nervous i'm like excited i'm so excited so we just got home of course we had to grab stella her favorite barbecue chips but we didn't grab too much. Um, we grabbed stuff for today and then food for tomorrow. These are gonna be for Tuesday morning, but I'll show you guys everything that we got. <laughs> we needed one more roll of toilet paper, so we grabbed that. We are gonna use smoked cheese. Is this Gouda, babe? Yeah. Yeah, okay, so the smoked Dutch Gouda cheese and salami. Oh, there's salami in here, but you said that's not enough. This little meat mixture, salami, prosciutto, and capicolo, which is really, really good. And also some olives. These are really good. I'm actually not a fan of olives, but these marinated olive duos from Trader Joe's are super delicious. I highly recommend trying them. We grabbed these multi-grain pita bite crackers. We also grabbed this cheese. This one's really good. It's a goat cheese, but it's vanilla and blueberry chevry. Anyways, this one's seasonal and it's always so good. I'm gonna do grapes on the cheese board. And then also we grabbed almond croissants, like I said, for Tuesday morning. We just grabbed a half dozen of eggs so that way we could have for breakfast tomorrow. We grabbed these roasted green beans, these roasted vegetables. This actually looks really good. I haven't tried that yet. Tomorrow for lunch, we're gonna make this turkey pot pie because we're gonna be doing a lot of packing. So we really don't have time to cook but also we don't want to eat out. So we're gonna have this for lunch tomorrow. We did grab two meats. This one is new, we haven't tried this one. Um, this balsamic and rosemary beef steak tips. It looked really good. And then this we haven't tried either, the peppered beef hanger steak. 
and I think that's everything that we got. We obviously grabbed a baguette because we're making, what are we making? Bruschetta, there we go. And then we also grabbed Parmesan for on top of the bruschetta. And then all we do for the bruschetta is use olive oil, tomato, and onion. And then we top it off with the cheese and bake it. So that's everything that we got today. Oh, also Andrew needed a box of tissues because his allergies have been acting up. That's everything that we got today. Honestly, we, like I said, we're not buying too much food. Oh my gosh, I look freaking exhausted. But I wanted to show you guys the rest of my Abercrombie order. So so let me see. I'm about to shower and make breakfast because I haven't eaten yet. So I showed you guys these two cardigans yesterday. I also picked, oh, oh goodness. I'm not going to try this on. I'm sure you guys will see me wear it, but I also picked up this bodysuit. Look how freaking cute this is. It's so soft. I got the size extra, extra small, and I thought this was just a great fall piece. Also, the sleeves are slightly puffed, which I love puff sleeves. And then I also picked up these sweats. So I wanted some new lounge sweats. I actually don't own a pair of sweats. I just own leggings and biker shorts. So I picked up these Abercrombie sweats. I kind of got it in like this charcoal blue color. And you guys, these are the softest sweats I think I've ever owned. I'm going to wear these on our flight over to Japan because I want to be cozy but still look kind of cute and put together. So I got the size extra, extra small in these. And these are from the soft collection and you guys honestly they are so soft i actually ordered a blush pair in my abercrombie order the other day so i'll show you guys those um when that order comes in this next week and then i also picked up this really cute cognac bell it's suede and i thought it would be perfect for fall i actually need to get a black leather one and I think they had one available, but I wanted to pick up this one first. Picked up this like nude bodysuit that could just go with any of the cardigans, jeans, shorts. I'm obsessed with bodysuits, so I figured this would be a good go-to. Except it's kind of like a bathing suit material. I'm sure you guys know what I mean, like how that bathing suit material is kind of just like slippery. So I'm not quite sure how I'm going to love to wear that. So I actually kept the receipt for that just in case. But yeah, so I look exhausted. But yeah, I'm gonna make some avocado toast, take a shower, get ready. And I think my friends are leaving at around 10.30, so they should be here at noon. And we're just gonna relax. I'm hungry. What do you want? Are you hungry? <laughs> Andrew, uh, are you hungry? You want avocado toast? <laughs> Stop! <laughs> no! <laughs> are you hungry? You're already eating your chips, Chunks. Yes. <laughs> photo little cracks on your rusty frame stuck in the model but it's okay vlog here thank you so much for hanging out with us or mostly me just running errands my friends should be here any minute so i'm going to go ahead and close the vlog out but thank you guys so much for watching the next video you guys will see will be the moving vlog please like and subscribe if you aren't already and i will see you guys in my next video